All right, ladies and gentlemen, you see the ICW Tag Team Champions to the top right hand side of the screen, the Dream Lovers, Dr. Love and Charlie Dreamer, as they are defending the ICW Tag Team titles tonight against the Anti-Hero League, as Vinny Vane there to your left, and Vax harassing the referee during the uh, pre-match check out there for foreign objects and everything. Adam Brookshire checking out Dr. Love, who appears to be starting for the Dream Lovers. This is a tremendous feud in the ICW history from running from about 2000 to 2003 to 2005. These two were the top tag teams in the ICW, along with the third team called East Coast Bodily Harm, which consisted of Big Daddy Chuck King and outlaw James Reno. These three teams continue trading the ICW tag team titles back and forth over and over. Right there you see Dr. Love and Vax, who will be starting for his team, is there standing in the middle of the ring. Can't understand what they're saying, but it appears that Dr. Love is, is explaining something to Vax because these guys have had some previous previous battles. As a matter of fact, Dr. Love and his partner Charlie Dreamer, the Dream Lovers, they won their tag titles by defeating Vax here in the end, the Vax and Vinny Vane of the Anti-Hero League. Vax and uh, Dr. Love exchanging words. Can't understand what they're saying. Hopefully they'll get the match underway here momentarily. Vax right there is pretty belligerent uh, in, in the face there of Dr. Love. And you see the manager of the Anti-Hero League right there at the bottom of the screen, J.R. Robbins. He also managed a man named Bloodlust. He went after the ICW, ta uh, ICW World title several times. Now uh, we got a lock up in Vax. Vax, Dr. Love to the turnbuckles. Oh, right there, Vax slaps his hand. Claims to the referee that Dr. Love slapped him on the break, which would have been an illegal break. Dr. Love says he didn't do it, which obviously he didn't do it. But the ref, referee, Adam Bookshire, from his vantage point, evidently couldn't tell. And Vax right here is just really selling to uh, Adam Bookshire that he got the that he got the hell slapped out of him. Now we got another lockup, Tyler Elbow lockup. Vax, Vax, Dr. Love back up into the corner again. Oh, right there, Vax does the same tactic, slaps his hands, claiming that Dr. Love slapped him when the referee ordered the break. Uh, looks like he's trying, I don't know, and then again, I don't understand this tactic for Vax at this point in time, because if you get the Dream Lovers disqualified, then they keep the belts. The Vax and Vinny Vane, the Anti-Hero League, could not win the belts if they, uh, somehow get uh, Dr. Love and Charlie Dreamer disqualified. You know, Adam Bookshire over there really going over what's going on right there now with a third collar lock up at elbow. Vax backs Dr. Love into the corner. Vax attempts the same thing, but referee Bookshire was watching this go around. Now Bookshire knows right there, schoolboy from behind from Dr. Love. It only gets a one, one count only. But Dr. Love took advantage of the situation and Vax is in the referee Brookshire's face. And he picked up the momentum and the offensive for his team right there. A nice hard shot. Slams Vax to the mat. Into the ropes. Comes off with a nice rollover. Into a leg drop. Dr. Love is on fire going to town with Vax. And referee out of Brookshire only gets a two count. Oh, I don't know what happened there. It looked like a low blow from Vax. That's exactly what it is, the way uh, Dr. Rose doubled over. Vax now gets the hit back for his team, pounding on Dr. Love at this point. Hard chop right there to Dr. Love. Looks like referee J.R. Robbins pulls uh, Dr. Love to the mat. Now Vax standing on his throat. Referee Adam Bookshire getting to the five count. Uh, once again, well, that is a violation of the rules. Vax has a five count to break, so technically he's not cheating just yet. And Vax right there arguing with the referee. Danny Vane coming into the ring. Distraction, distraction. J.R. Roberts choking, choking Dr. Love over there. Vax taunting Charlie Dreamer at this point. As Dr. Love right now is in a world of trouble and he's getting, he's getting pounded by Vax as well as their manager, J.R. Robbins. Vax pulls him out and back into the center of the ring. Right there, it looks like the anti-hero leader is pretty serious about winning the belt back, be winning the tag belts back tonight. 
make themselves two times ICW champions. Hard shot right there to the hamstring. Now, J.R. Robbins, he's up on the ring apron. Adam Brookshire wisely struggling to get down. But that set back up for that low blow you just saw. Henry Vane, he's looking pretty cocky and pretty confident. But himself nor Charlie Dreamer have been in the match yet at this point. Oh, Vax right there with a headbutt. Looked like a low blow head, but it obviously is the way Adam Bookshire is all over Vax, threatening to throw him out and disqualify him. Tag. Now we're going to see Vinny Vane for the first time in this match. Right there as he stomps the back of Dr. Love, cutting him off from making a tag to Charlie Dreamer, who needs to get in the ring because Dr. Love has definitely been on the receiving end of some tremendous punishment thus far at this point in the match. Oh, Vinny Vane just throws him. To the, to, to the corner to tag Charlie Dreamer. I don't quite understand that move. When you're trying to win the world titles, why are you going to take a beaten man and throw him to a fresh opponent? I don't quite understand that move. The arrogance of Billy Vane could come back to haunt the team. But Billy Vane talking to the crowd. Charlie Dreamer trying to get the crowd rallied behind him. Collar and elbow lockup. Right there, Charlie Dreamer with a go behind. Takes him to the mat. Oh, but look at that. Vinny Vane turns back around and then just uh, tries to uh, slap and taunt his man. Vinny Vane's confidence and cockiness right now could cost his team the match. I mean, I mean, they need the win to win the belts. They don't, they don't understand the move. Now Charlie Dreamer returning the favor, smacking uh, and spanking Vinny Vane. Charlie Dreamer, Charlie Dreamer is definitely getting the best of Vinny Vane, but like I said, I don't understand Vinny Vane's attitude and cockiness at this point thus far in the match. Right there, we get back to a collar and elbow lockup. We see the sign guy for ICW in the far corner. Right there, Dr. Love gets after uh, J.R. Robbins, but Vinny Vane has got control of the match inside the ring right now. It's not a headlock. Crowd's really into this match as you people as you can hear. Right there, they just reverse some uh, hammer locks. Right there, flip over. Drop kick by Charlie Dreamer. Vinny Vane, another drop kick. Vinny Vane sits over with a third drop kick. Charlie Dreamer. Vinny Vane wisely rolls outside the ring to break the momentum. However, I've got to go back to, I don't understand Vinny Vane's cockiness, but he threw a beaten Dr. Love over the tag of fresh Charlie Dreamer. I just don't understand what the Lord is thinking. Now you see uh, J.R. Robbins up on the way talking to the referee. You see Vinny Vane right there calling for a timeout. You know, there are no timeouts in professional wrestling. But, manager J.R. Robbins, you know, he's staying right there on top of Adam Brookshire so that the uh, we can't keep a count going. You see Charlie Dreamer finally breaking that up. J.L. Robbins sneaking around the other side of the ring as Vinny Vane and Vax climb up right here. Robbins distracting Robbins over there, aggravating Dr. Love. You see Dr. Love on the floor. Vinny Vane and Charlie Dreamer are two legal right there. Vinny Vane attacks Dr. Love from behind. Then he, he's left and got a shot there on Charlie Dreamer. Chicken wing suplex. Vinny Vane tags Vax. Vax is coming back in. Vax is the biggest man in this match. Don't be fooled by Vax. He's a legit about 6'6", six, 6'7". Six, six, He's a pretty tall individual, very strong individual as well. Right there, he measured Charlie Dreamer and then threw an uppercut. Right there, you see Vax distracting the referee as Vinny Vane chokes. Charlie Dreamer there on the bottom rope. Vinny Vane and Vax, now they, they both got into the business, uh, started wrestling professionally in 1999. Right there you see Vax choking Charlie Dreamer. And the Dream Lovers didn't come about until around 2002-2003. And uh, Vax and Vinny Vane, I mean, they, they're lifelong friends, they're pretty much brothers growing up together. And you know, they, they train together, you know, they hang out together. Right there you see Vax. Vax just breaking the back of Charlie Dreamer. 
I mean, these guys right here, I mean, this is, this is legitimate, I'm telling you, it's not a storyline. These guys are just like brothers, and you see Vax there lifting his shirt up on Charlie Draymer. A lot of oh, 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 a hard chop to the back. But uh, Vax and Vinny Vane, you know, they've grown up together, they're, they're, they're best friends. You know, they're, they're, they're like brothers, to be honest with you. And, and these guys, you know, they're always together right there. Oh, Vax right there with a hard foot to the face. Now, Charlie Dreamer and uh, Dr. Love, right there, you see Vax sitting in love. And these guys are good friends, but they just don't have the history that Vax and Vinny Vane do right there as Vax drops a leg drop across. There's an arrogant pin. Dr. Love in to break it up. Vax very, very slow to get back to his man, but he prevents him from making a tag and drags him back to the ring, tags in Vinny Vane. We're going to see Vinny Vane go back to work one more time. Right there with a leg drop of his own to the back of the neck there of uh, Charlie Dreamer. Right, shoots, a good vein, rather shoot guts under. Oh, right there now, vein shot, Charlie Dreamer to the rope, he ducked the clothesline, ducked with elbow, and then he, he was met with a spinning heel kick. Hey, caught Vane right there. Vane almost got the three count with his feet on the rope. Right there you see Dr. Love and Charlie Dreamer, uh, excuse me, Dr. Love and Vax fighting outside the ring as Benny Vane is continuing to punish Charlie Dreamer in the ring. This match is working loose at this point. Adam Brookshire, he's now concerned with uh, Dr. Love and Vax fighting outside the ring. Benny Vane calling for I don't know what Vinny Vane, Vinny Vane's reaching for something. Vinny Vane now has a chair, but Adam Brookshire, referee Adam Brookshire is back in the ring. And he's caught, he's caught that Vane, or excuse me, Vinny Vane trying to bring the chair into the ring. Adam Brookshire's attention once again is going back on the, the fight that's ensuing outside the ring. As Vinny Vane right there now has the chair in the ring. He puts his foot on the floor to Charlie Dreamer. Opening, but that, they better do what he's going to do with the chair before you know Adam Brookshire. You know, I don't know before he comes back in the ring. I don't know. Like, from his vantage point, I can't exactly tell what's going on with Vax and Doctor Love out there. Vinny Vane just Vinny Vane once again, the arrogance and cockiness is not he's not following through with whatever he intends to do with that chair. Right there, he turned around and hit it. Charlie Dreamer drop kicked the chair, hit Vinny Vane with it. Adam Brookshire, I guess he knows this is a title match, he's going to let it go. As Charlie Dreamer covered Vane and Vax made the save, uh, Adam Brookshire realizes this is a uh, you know, high-stakes title match. But these are the two top teams in ICW, and he, he let it go. Charlie Dreamer makes the tag, makes the hot tag, Vane makes the tag. Now we're going we're gonna to be met right here, right there. We're going to get a pretty even lockup right here. Oh, right there, a flip to the midsection. Uppercut, Dr. Love now in trouble. If Dr. Love had to storm the ring when the tag was made, he'd have been all over Vinny Vane at this point, but it didn't work out that way. And Dr. is in control at this point. Hard right hand to Dr. Love. Elbow to the top of the head on Dr. Love. Vax right now is in control of this match. Looks like he's... he's I can't exactly tell what he's doing to Dr. Love, but he's definitely got Vinny Vane. Looks like Vinny Vane may have passed himself, but I'm not, like I said, I'm not real sure from my vantage point. You see the same vantage point I am, ladies and gentlemen. Looks like Vax has a belt of some kind in his hand. He does. He has a belt. He's choking. He's choking Dr. Love with it. Now referee Adam Brookshire on top of that. Charlie Dreamer breaks it up. Adam Brookshire's definitely giving these guys a lot of leeway. Dude, he had a belt being used in the ring. Adam Brookshire gets the belt outside the ring, but now it's back in the hands of manager J.R. Robbins. Don't know that much better than it was. But Vax pounding on Dr. Love again at this point. The anti-hero league has been pretty much in control of this whole match. And Dr. Love firing back. Dr. Love with a DDT on Vax. Oh, Dr. Love with a nice kip up. 
Uh, Lord, you need to follow through. You need to follow through if you're going to keep the tag bumps because Vinny Daniel Bax have been on fire tonight. Shoots Bax to the ropes, meets him with a hard elbow right there to the side of the head. Right now we got the tag. Charlie Dreamer's coming back in the ring. Actually, Charlie Dreamer climbing the ropes. Vinny Vane lifting Bax to off his, lifting Bax to his feet. Turns Bax around and he's met with a nice, nice uh, axe handle shot right there. Charlie Dreamer antagonizing Vane. Gets the two count on Vax. Right now the Dream Lovers are in charge for probably the first time since the opening of the match. Right there, a nice drop kick sends Vax to the back. The Dream Lovers had better follow through. Better follow through on this one because Vinny Vane and Vax are definitely after the tag titles tonight held by the Dream Lovers. Right there, the Dream Lovers right there with another quick tag. Love back in, pounding on Vax, shooting Vax to the ropes. Vax reverses it. Vax right there with a clothesline on Dr. Love. Vax a little worse for wear though. He needs to make a tag to Vinny Vane. But if he doesn't, Dr. Love may be in the better shape of the two at this point in time. As you see referee Adam Bookshark counting both men. Vax makes his tag. Vinny Vane's coming in the ring. Right there, Vax and Vinny Vane got control. They do a quick double team. Vinny Vane with a body slam. It looks like into a hoogie driver almost right there. Vane setting him up. Vane talking the crowd. Wait a minute, Vinny Vane and Vax working on a double team move of some kind. And they both drop an elbow on the fallen Dr. Love at this point. Vinny Vane going for the pin as he's the leading man in the ring. Charlie Dreamer making the save. This has been one great tag team match for the ICW tag team titles right there as Vinny Vane sends Charlie Dreamer down to the mat. Excuse me, Dr. Love, and then he turns around and slaps Charlie. He hits Charlie Dreamer, flips him into the ring. He's calling for Vane to come in. Four men in the ring at this point in time. Shoot both men into the ropes. Vax with a DDT. Charlie Dreamer clotheslines Vinny Vane. Bulldogs Vax. Met with a clothesline by Vinny Vane. He's met with a clothesline from Dr. Love. Oh, choke slam right there. Vax caught Dr. Love with a choke slam. Vax is out of it, however. These guys are really taking a toll on each other. Charlie Dreamer lifting Vax up. Vinny Vane on his feet there on the side of the ring. As Charlie Dreamer pounds on Vax. Dr. Love slowly getting his feet right there. Vax has Charlie Dreamer lifted up. Oh, right there, he presses him. Charlie Dreamer a kick that really had no effect right there, a drop kick, and now Charlie Dreamer goes for the pin on Vax. Referee Bookshot Cowton. J.R. Robbins breaks it. Vinny Vane with a super kick there on Dr. Love. Vane to the top rope, drops a uh, kick. It looked like he dropped an elbow there on uh, Charlie Dreamer. He puts Vax on top of Charlie Dreamer. One, two, three count. Three count win. I believe it's a three. Yes, it's a three count. We have new tag team champions, the Anti Hero League. Vinny Vane and Vax are the new ICW tag team champions. Stay tuned for me, Mark Ash, and Dark Star.